Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to try and set up single sign-on for the Salesforce application using SAML protocol. Before directly jumping to the setup, let me give you a brief about a few features. Salesforce brings companies and customers together on its number one cloud-based CRM platform. Using MiniOrange's SAML single sign-on solution for Salesforce, users can log in effortlessly and securely to multiple Salesforce web and mobile apps with a single set of login credentials. First, we will set up a custom domain in Salesforce to do SSO. After that, we need to configure MiniOrange as an IDP by filling in the URL values obtained from the Salesforce application. Then we will configure the Salesforce application as a service provider by filling the metadata values obtained from the MiniOrange application. At last, we will test the configuration done in the above steps by initiating the SSO flow from the Salesforce application. Let's create a custom domain in order to do SSO into Salesforce. Log into your Salesforce account. Click on the setup icon in the top right section of the page. Now in the search field, search for the My Domain settings. Choose your domain name and check for its availability. If available, Proceed by saving the settings. Search for company information in the search bar. Copy organization ID which we will require later. Let's configure Salesforce in MiniOrange IDP. To add the Salesforce application to the MiniOrange dashboard, click on Setup under the Setup app card. Now click on the SAML section and search for Salesforce. Fill in the given values in the respective fields. You can also get these URLs from the detailed setup guide provided in the description of this video. Edit the domain name and customer ID which we got from Salesforce as prerequisite. Click on Attribute Mapping. Click on Add Attribute and enter the attribute names with their values as shown. You can get the correct value of user profile ID and attribute names from the detailed setup guide provided in the description of this video. Click on Save. You have successfully set up the Salesforce application into MiniOrange. Now click on the Select button against your newly created application. Go to Metadata. Click on Information required to set MiniOrange's IDP and copy the SAML login URL, IDP entity ID or issuer, and click on the Download Certificate button to download the certificate which we will require later. Now, let's switch to the Salesforce application to configure Salesforce as a service provider. Click the gear icon, then navigate to Setup, Identity, Single Sign-On Settings. On the Single Sign-On Settings page, click on Edit. Check the SAML enabled box to enable the use of SAML Single Sign-On, then click on Save. Click New to open SAML Single Sign-On Settings. Configure the details as given below which we have saved from MiniOrange. Click on Save. Copy your login URL value which we will use for login. Now, let's test the SSO login to your Salesforce account with MiniOrange IDP. Go to your Salesforce subdomain login page and click Login with MiniOrange. Enter your MiniOrange login credential and click on Login. You will be automatically logged in to your Salesforce homepage. If you have any questions regarding Salesforce SSO or provisioning configuration, feel free to drop us a query at IDP support at securify.com, or you can drop a comment in the comments section and we will reach out to you at the earliest.